Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I don't agree, and I will not agree with regard to Shagwa at this moment. Kuamba msama kwa mama ngina kenyata. Uliwa kejeli. You insulted them. Uliwaita majina wezi. Land grabbers. You said all things about Kenyatta's family. For you to fit into the politics of the mountain. You have realized that the politics of the mountain is not welcoming you. Kando na kuwakijeli Kenyatta's family. He's saying that this is the news we are getting. D.P. Rigadi Gashagwa apologizes to former first lady Mamangina Kenyatta to what he termed as bad politics during the 2022 general election campaign period. D.P. Gashagwa pleaded with the former first lady to find it in her heart and forgive the political fraternity for mad slinging her. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching this video and you have not liked this video, please do me a favor and show you like this video. When you like this video, you support the channel. We are having a fundraising to support uh, Guadalupe Children's Home. Already, we are having a good number that has already contributed. I want to appreciate you so much. If you're willing to contribute and support this mission, please, you can assist us by contributing either 100 book challenge or you can contribute what you have. I will appreciate you so much. We're going to have this fundraising for one week. Then we present our donation date 3rd of April. I will select few individuals, supporters and subscribers of this channel. We'll present together with them at Guadalupe Children's Home. I will appreciate you so much. Consider dropping and donating your contribution through the M-Pesa number 0759-958201. I will appreciate you so much. Now, let us go back to the main discussion. Do you remember during the demonstration when Uhuru Mege Kenyatta's, let me say Kenyatta's family, land, ilikuwa raide, not lands. Na hatu kiangalia hafi jana wenye walitumwa huko. で、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、ごめん、
Let them just keep quiet. So that Kenyans, we must learn a lesson. If you are in politics, it will not give you a mileage in politics for just insulting a family. Ulifanya your family wa kuena tension? Some part of the demonstration uh, period, Mamangina's security even ilikuwa withdrawn. You saw even Uhuru Kenyatta see, they shared their security with her, with his mother. Today, what they passed through, it was extremely out of politics. This was just simply a grudge. Then you came out, na kuwa kejeli still. Jano wakisema, wanafikiria sana vila watasaidia wati ya mbao. Hata kama wajia saidia wa kutoka 1963, hawajia chelewa. Kwa sababu, kuma mbao na watotoa wako na shida. Hile tunauliza tunu wa saidia na jia amana. Hile mashamba yote wanichukua ya mbao mbao, waangalia hata kama ni lusu. Wape watu ya mbao mbao na watoto yao ni kwemo. And so we are asking, Shida, they are not late. Of course, from 1963, they have never bothered. Now that they have come and they are saying they are concerned, na wati ya maumau, watu saidie. Because wenyewe di wanchukua mashamba yote ya maumau, swara dizo sinakula huko, sinatembea huko, una kazi na hivya kwa hiyo mashamba, maumau na watoto yao wanaziko kwa public cemetery. Tunauliza hao tu kama wamepata hiyo roho Mungu amewaguza kuonea watu ya maumau na watoto yao huruma <laughs> wa consider because hii mashaba ni kubwa sana So for me I think mama Gina should keep quiet Let her keep quiet Because your insult using her to balkanize Mount Kenya into dynasty versus Hassel and Dooms. Regarding the Shago pretends to offer an olive branch to her because he's under siege. I think Mama Gina must reject this hypocrisy of regarding the Shago. Nabado, on top of asking for forgiveness from Mama Gina Kenyatta, Gashagwa is going to pass a very kind of dangerous situation. Not only in the mountain, but across the Republic of Kenya. We cannot have a deputy president who is senseless, clueless, planless, rudderless. He doesn't understand even what to do as a deputy president. I have analyzed just a video here regarding Shago saying that he's the deputy president of the mountain that is ensuring that the mountain is benefiting more in this government. Excuse me, you were elected the deputy president of the Republic of Kenya. Who is the deputy president of lawyers? Who is the deputy president of Luos, Kambas, Kisi? You want to tell me you are elected to represent the mountain? I think the priority of regarding Shago is wrong. It is so wrong and he is going to regret for what he did. You know, I'm really sorry for surely. Geshogwa is saying that he is really sorry for involving Mamangina in last general elections politics. That he therefore asked for forgiveness on behalf of the team. It means they had a team to balkanize and frustrate black men, Kenyatta's family, so that they, they were to have a mileage in the politics of the mountain. So regarding the Shagwa realized that that unity is looking for, is not favoring him. No, he's looking for those who individuals whom he insulted, frustrated, called the names thieves. And by the way, Regarding the Shago told us that he, Kenyatta's family, will go on a paper person number boxes. If Alijua, kwa mba watu niwezi, mbona naomba msama. 
Mbona alikuwa anaomba anaomba msamaha? It is so so shocking. Nyinyi muliana vile when well read mashamba za mama ngina Kenyatta you saw them you want to tell me kwani wakina regali wako na mali ya yenye it is in accordance to the, to the law kama ujaambia mwingine toa kitu kwa macho hakikisha umetoa yako kwanza because you cannot convince me that regali ya shamba alipata mali yake ile straightforward you cannot come out and say you are a thief then at the same time you are the thief you know na ile narrative regarding shabu alikuja nayo ni kwamba anaona kwamba aliona ni kana kwamba mountain ilikuwa inaenda kunuendosha na by the way let me tell you the tears of mama ngina ya 2022 equation never think that mama ngina's kenyatta's tears ilifanya mpaka Kenyatta's family walienda kuishi UK Did you saw that mama ngina Kenyatta wakibebana wakienda UK because of the threats of Akinarigali na Shaw na Kimani Shungwa they were already failing their, their community they are just fighting things that are not there we have more shares we have more shares but literally you're not benefiting them You have members of parliament who can of course they should come out and fight for the people. You are using them for your someone's agenda. Your people they're not benefiting. Now shamefully regarding the shabwa is appointing an avocado task force for what purpose? You have the majority members of parliament, you have the majority leader Kimani Shugwa just directing let him amend the the bill then things are, go, are well to go but now you've realized the politics that you you've been playing is contrary to your expectations you thought like you are going to be popular just to balkanize and destroy the kenyatta's family to make you a, 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 a mileage in the politics of mountain i think regarding shagwa should should feel sorry for himself sure It is not good. For him, ameona kila kitu ina fail. What do you say? What do you say? You 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 asking for forgiveness. You realize that you wronged the Kenyatta family. Were watching. You played politics with their name. You thought that you were going to be to be popular. Now ndio hiyo kina kukanyaga ladies and gentlemen what do you think drop your opinion at the comment section below otherwise thank you so much because of your support please consider subscribing liking commenting and sharing this video we are doing fundraising to support god alupe children so ready those who have uh, contributed we want to appreciate you so much if you're looking forward to contribute you can contribute through the mpesa number 07 59958201 we are going to have a fundraising for one week the debt card uh, i'm going to select few uh, subscribers here supporters we go present the donation i will appreciate you so much so please donate what you have and at the same time we are having a challenge of 100 bob bye bye till you meet on another video